Okay, I'm going to show you how to add shapes like these ones to a Google uh, map for your geography project. I'm going to go to My Places, first of all, and click on Create Map. It gives me a brand new map, give it a title. Um, tourist Destinations, for example. Give it a description, the best tourist destinations in the world, or whatever you want to call it, depending on your project. Tourist uh, Destinations in the World and um, start to edit it. So I bring my map up to where I want, the continents I want to involve in this, um, bring my zoom so I can see them all, or I can zoom in further, closer, obviously, if I want to be closer to the continent I'm using, and draw a shape. Then I take the shape tool and I select the area that I would like to draw the shape on. So just, um, if I want to be more exact, I'll, I, I would zoom in a bit further. Okay, depending on how big this map is going to be on the end. Now, this is defaulted to my, la my latest settings. If I click on this, I can change the line color. I can change the fill color. I can change the, the width of the line, make it more narrow. I can make it hugely wide as well, which is probably not, not so good for this map. So I'm going to bring it back down to 5. Um, the line opacity, is it, do I want it to be opaque or do I, want it to be, do I want it to stand out or do I want it to be kind of transparent looking? You can modify that. Um, fill color we've done. And then if you want to be able to see through the fill of it, you might want to bring that down a little bit as well. So I'm going to put it at 50. Notice now I can see the, I've lowered the opacity so I can see the, the country name below. And then OK. Give it a name. Um, Columbia. And a description. And then click OK. And then you're done. So if you want to add another one, again, you take a draw shape. And you select an area that you want to outline. This will automatically default to the colors I used last time. So if I want to change those again, I go in, change my colors. I'm going to leave it the same opaqueness for each one. It's not doesn't look very nice there. Let's change that. Something perhaps a bit more interesting. And OK. Again, title, uh, Northern Mexico. And OK. And we're done. Again, you can print this off when you're done. You save it. Say done. You can print it, you can link to it, share it with your, you can collaborate on it with your teacher and share it to te with your teacher and your friends. Or you can do a screenshot using a Shift Command 4 on a Mac, Shift Command 3 for the entire screen, or the snipping tool if you're on a Windows computer. And that's it.